Hi, my name is Michael Mann and welcome to my making of the Marble Machines video. This video is way overdue for the fact that when I made this thing it was 2008, 14 years ago. So the footage from the video that you're going to see, uh, the procedures, was taken a long, long time ago and I never did anything with it other than saved it on my computer for someday I knew I'd figure I'd uh, make this video. Um, I did not come up with this idea. I first saw this idea at a woodworking trade show. A fella had one sitting on a table and I walked over, turned the handle and kind of fell in love with the idea. I ended up asking him if I could take a couple of pictures of it. Um, I didn't really take any measurements. Um, the one that he had made did not come apart and be put together like mine is. His was uh, basically glued together, which is great. It worked. On, on mine, I wanted to make mine come apart for a couple of reasons. Number one, when you have a machine that has moving parts, uh, parts are going to break possibly, and it's easier to repair parts or clean parts if you can take the thing apart. Okay, and so rather than using wood metal wood screws, I decided to go with, um, I happen to have a be all wood threader that helps make these wooden nuts and bolts. And I thought that would be a clever way to make this thing come apart, put together. So when it's put together, obviously it's a, uh, working machine turn the handle the marbles go up and down and because it comes apart it's also like a puzzle uh, it's I don't know, there's probably 40 or 50 parts to this thing so once it's taken apart unless you really have seen it before it would be quite a challenge to be able to put back together I would think um, so in the video today I will include measurements of how to make one of these uh, but I'll tell you, there's going to be segments in the video you're going to say, wait a minute, that's a different color of wood. Or uh, that's a little bit different size. Well, I've ended up making four or five of these over the years. And I videotaped a little bit of each one. Um, they all work the same principle, although they all are, are all slightly different sizes. But the sizes that I'm giving in the video will work to build one continuous machine and work okay. So anyway, sit back and enjoy whether you're watching this to because you want to make one, great, you'll probably learn something, or maybe you just want to kick back and be entertained. All right, thanks for watching.